Oh, we got her. Okay, so you can tell, title this video, getting every perma perk in one video. I was going to try and do this on uh, one game, like one game of zombies. Yeah, that's that's not uh, that's not possible. So, um, yeah. So I think there's a total of 14 perma perks. And one of them I can't get because I have, you know, no friends to uh, help me do it. Uh, but the first one perk I'm going to go for, I did reset my stats on this account for this particular video. I regret doing it because, well, uh, you might know why. So just just don't worry about it right now. We'll, we'll get to it in the future. So the first one perk I'm going to go for is double pistol points. So I think all you got to do is have less than 20% accuracy with pistols and get like, I don't know, a certain amount of kills. Not sure how many. I, it can, I think it range from like anywhere from like 3 to fucking, I don't know, 10. So I w emptied all my ammo. I'll go ahead and get to knifing these guys. Eventually, I should, theoretically, possibly, get a permanent perk. and skill. Okay. That, you know, whatever. Sure. Oh, I think I got it. So I got that green miss, as you saw. I don't actually have any ammo in my pistol, so I can't quite show it yet. And the only problem with this perk is you can't actually get kills. I don't think. Either you can't get kills, or you have to have 100% accuracy. Uh, and then you met uh, if you don't have 100% accuracy then you lose it. I could be completely wrong I don't 100% know I guess we will find out if I get that notific or that little sound that I lost it Which will really suck if I if I have lost it But I guess we can get to uh, getting our next one perk, which is the ray gun Now to get this you have to just basically buy the Olympia and keep buying ammo for it over and over Until you actually get the ray gun now the only way to actually be able to do this one perk is you have to be either the one bone or two bone rank which, uh, Since I reset my stats and completely fucked everything on my account I am one bone rank. Should have just made a new account because, uh, well, I'm big sad. Let's go ahead and buy ammo. Boom. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Literally the first ammo buy is a ray gun. There you go. Okay, we got we got ammo. We got ammo. So, uh, let's look at our points really quick while I shoot this guy in the leg. Yeah, as you see, I got two, uh, two tens. I'll, sh I'll show it again. So, I'm just going to shoot this guy. Normally, you get, uh, 80 points, right? But, since I have this normal perk, theoretically, I should get 160. So, I should be at 1,060 points after this. 1080 my bad well either way it, it still works so that's two permanent perks off the list so i don't gotta write those anymore oh double points this is actually gonna be crazy uh oh oh uh. oh we got missy again all right cool cool now the next thing i can go for uh let's see here i do need a lot of points early on so i might go for the long shot permanent perk which is get five long shot sniper kills so i'm gonna try to get the fuck what's it called uh the svu and just get a lot of points with that get like the perma perk and let's see i couldn't work my way to get this next one so next one is you have to buy a perk and prone under it and then you have to do that multiple times until eventually you will obviously get the green mist and when you buy one perk it gives you a thousand back in return pretty cool but uh i can't do that quite yet there's the svu all right, now we got the SVU. Now, all we need to do is get long shot kills, about five of them. I, I won't be able to get it this round, sadly, because I've already killed two zombies, and there's only six zombies in round one. But in order to get this, you basically just come all the way back here, or any part that has a very long distance, and you just got to get sniper kills from all the way back, really far away. I think you only have to get five of them. Oh, okay, I think I got it now. If I kill a zombie, yep, there we go. As you see, my points are basically just racking up. This is going to be super helpful for, for later on, of course. There is a perma perk, which is perma tombstone, but you have to buy um, four perks before round five and do that three times. So I got to do that in three different games, and I think I get perma tombstone. So I can't quite do that this game, but later games I should be able to. Maybe I can do it this game, actually. So it's not going to be like a consistent flow to this video since well, I'm, it's kind of all over the place, and I can kind of just do different uh, perma perks at different times. Uh, okay, that insta kill can actually be really helpful right now. So, you need to actually get two insta-kills and not kill a single zombie on either one. And that will give you another perma perk, which is the red insta-kill. Um, we'll, we'll get to that once we get to that. Got a free Ali our boy Leroy. This man ain't do nothing, bro. Look at him. Look at this guy. He's so scared. He's scared. Don't worry, Leroy. I got you some booze. There you go, my guy. We actually might be able to buy three perks before round five. Or four perks. Probably do that. Mule cake probably isn't our best option, but, uh, well, it's my option. So, there you go. Okay, there's another piece of booze. Let's see if I can get this long shot from here. With Leroy. Hey, go, my guy. Go. Go, my queen. Oh, he might make it. Yo, let's go. Boom. Too easy, man. Just that easy. Where is this last zombie at? Where is this guy? Oh, there he is. 
Oh, and a double points. Okay, we need this for another primer perk. This is all over the place, man. This is all over the place. So this next one, which is half off, from what I have in my notes, you need to get 2,500 points during a double points. And during another double points, you have to spend 1,000 points. So it's a little weird, but I think combined with this, um, the sniper long shot perma perk, I should be able to easily get 2,500. I think I've already passed that mark. So we, uh, we should be good. I gotta try to save one zombie though. I don't want to kill all of them. We definitely got 3,500 points at double points. Or 3,500, 2,500. All right, let's go buy Speed Cola for our fourth perk. There we go. So that's four perk, or yeah, four perks before round five, right? Yeah, it's three times as well. I'm going to two separate games and do that again. So I guess all I need to do now is hopefully... Oh, th there we go. Insta-kill. I need that. So basically, I just got to not kill a single zombie during this insta-kill. And I should get the next promo perk. Oh, I got it. As you see, the green mist right there. So next time I get an insta-kill, I should have red insta-kill. Double points. Okay, so here I think all I have to do is spend a thousand points. Easiest way to do that is simply just hitting the box. And there is another perma perk. Obviously, uh, most of you should know that it's the teddy bear perma perk. It's basically just better box luck. And for what I have in my notes is you just have to take every weapon you get out of the box, just like the Rega Mark II, for example, and simply take everything before round 10 until you get the teddy bear perma perk. There we go. I didn't actually get the green miss for that double point, so I don't know. Maybe maybe I just got to wait. Oh, well, there's that perma perk, so I can mark that off the list as well. Uh, I'm not sure what to do right now. I might try to get the perma PhD, uh, or the just the PhD perma perk. So all you got to do is just flop about five to ten times. One more time should do it. Yep, there we go. So now I should have perma PhD. If I hold out a sniper, I think this actually works on the sniper as well. Yeah, you get a lot of points by flopping and using a sniper. Like, you can combine the two perma perks. Way too many points. Oh, wait, what? Maybe not. Hold on. Maybe I'm tripping balls. I don't know. Do gotta get a lot of points in the bank, though. Okay, so I just realized there's also another perma perk where you have to get two or more collateral headshot kills five times. Then the easiest way I could go about doing this is just training up the zombies and getting headshot kill, like collateral headshot kills. And they gotta got the DSR for that. I don't think it matters what gun, but I'm gonna assume snipers are the best for this. Mm. Collateral headshot kills are a lot harder than I remember them being. Okay, so I got an insta kill here. So I should have red insta kill, right? Yeah, I do. So basically, zombies, they touch you, they die. That, that's kind of it. I mean, I don't. I, 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 yeah. Okay, getting this. this th these, these headshots in a row might be. A lot harder than I thought. Okay, let's see if this half off from our perk actually works. So, I'm gonna hit the- or by the door. 1250? Oh, uh, it's only 750! Mm. So, I guess that the combining the sniper from our perk doesn't actually work. That kinda sucks, not gonna lie there. Okay, so I've pretty much gotten all the way- I know, oh no, it's only round 9. I, I know, but like, I've gotten a DSR with iron sights, so getting- this extra headshot damage perma perk, which is getting two or more head, two more collateral headshots five times in a row, should be much easier. But maybe, just maybe, that isn't actually how you do it. It could be completely wrong. I might have to look it up if I just can't get it. Oh, wait, I think I got it. I mean, I got, I, I got it. I got something, but you won't really be able to tell. But I was getting headshots, so I'm assuming I got that off the list. All this is is just give you extra headshot damage. Not really any way of actually knowing if i got it or not so uh i guess we'll just hope we got it all right so all we need to hope for now is just another double points because me no, me thinking me, me big brain me small brain there there it is dude so i'm gonna have to try to get 2500 points i should be able to i'm trying to get all headshots and i should should be able to get it i just need 2500 points and then on another double points i gotta spend a thousand points my notes could be completely wrong but who the fuck knows right well, I got something. I got a green. I got green mist, and I was on a double point. It could have been half off. So next time, was a double points. I'm gonna have to see. I do need my boy Leroy to actually break the well though, so I can go back to spawn because there's another uh, another perma perk I'm trying to get that involves barriers. Ooh, his his booze is in the cell. Um, where's my boy Leroy at? There he is. There is this guy. Thank you, my queen. Go. Yes, sir. I just gotta hope the lights turn back on because I do want another perk when I go back to spawn. Oh, double points. Okay, best way to know if this actually another double points. Okay, well, let's go hit the box and if it's cheaper than 950, we will know. 
475. Look at that, dude. Put the AN in there real quick and go take the Blessed Knife because we can get our last two perks. And just for like a little 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 trick, if tricks and tips, if you didn't know this, to get uh, another an extra perk from the Witch's House, you got to stand behind this line, hit the middle, get 100 points. If piano's playing, there you go. Show you how to get another perk, man. All right, after you shoot that little dart thing, the piano is playing. I know it's not part of the video. I don't, I don't give a fuck. You come to the back of the witch's house, and there should be a witch. <gasps> Whoa! There should be a witch playing a piano. You just got to tip her 10 cents, and boom, there you go. Perk. Easy mode. Bro, stop stealing my, my cash coochie. I need it all. Pick my girl out on a date, man. Now all I got to do is get back to spawn, because I got to rebuild a lot of barriers. And that is the really the only place I could think of that actually has a lot of barriers I can rebuild. Go! Oh. I just realized I don't have the paralyzer. I can't get up. Yay! Oh, there it is, dude. There it is. Gotta get back to spawn now. Now, all I got to do now is basically just rebuild all the barriers. There is a perma perk where I gotta kill a zombie in a barrier while there is a carpenter. So, uh. Uh, you, you know, I gotta, <laughs> gotta hope, man. Just gotta hope. But the uh, the the perma perk I'm actually going for right at this moment is rebuilding 74 barriers after round 10. It is a shitload of barriers, but I gotta do it for the video. And a carpenter. Ooh, a carpenter didn't really come at a good time. I gotta hope I don't get a carp. I mean, I either gotta hope I get a carpenter at like the beginning of a round, or I get a carpenter later on, because I need to try to get what I'm trying to get now, which is rebuild 74 barriers as around 10 as I said. Get off my barrier, bro. Well, I guess I gotta let them break it, so get in the barrier, bro. Hey, you can't just hop through without my permission, dog. What are you doing? I understand why people do not sit and spawn on this map. It is fucking torturous. Yeah, I think my next drop is going to be a carpenter. No, it's not. Okay. Oh, I think I got steel barriers now. Yep, look at that. Right there. There's proof. All I need now is to, uh, well, hope I get a carpenter spawning in. I guess it doesn't really matter that I already built barriers now. I'm just going to do it just in case. Because why not? I don't know the best place. I think the best place here is to just hold a zombie in this barrier and just kill all the zombies that come here. And once a carpenter happens and I'm holding a zombie at a window, got to kill the zombie while there's a carpenter and bang, there you go. I guess my next drop isn't a carpenter. Okay. I'm 20 in. Still no carpenter. Yay. I've gotten like every drop ever other than what I'm looking for. Actually kind of makes me upset. Bro, I'm starting to think carpenters don't even spawn in later rounds anymore. Bro, if I was a carpenter, I would have literally cried. Oh wait, I think there has to be a certain amount of barriers unbuilt. Shit. Maybe that's why this is so difficult. Okay, so I'm gonna have all of the barriers broken. And then I'm gonna go down here and have them break some more barriers that I just gotta hope man. Yeah, this makes sense now, because I'm pretty sure that there needs to be a certain amount. Yep, just like that. No! It's not fair! This really shouldn't be this hard, but it just it just is, man. At least I know now. Hold oh, he's a walker too. Perfect. Oh, I'm red screen. This isn't good. I don't know if a carpenter's gonna spawn anymore. Man, why is this gotta be so hard? Transit probably be the easiest map to do this on, to be honest. I didn't think about that. Mm. I just need them to break like all the barriers. That'd be a little hard to get a carpenter. I'm not gonna lie. That's well, gonna be a lot easier, but I uh, severely underestimated how hard a carpenter is to get when you actually need it. There it is, dude. We got it. We got it. Oh. Okay, I gotta gotta bounce. So now all I want to try to do now is get a carpenter and show that I got it. But if I get another carpenter, the barriers should be steel. I gotta try to get them to break more barriers again. I just I just want to show you guys this, so uh, if there's anyone that's like, well, you see here, buddy, you, you didn't you didn't do it because you didn't show it. I'm like, yeah, okay, dude. Like, what did you do for content, hmm? other than fucking go in the comment section, think you're cool? Sorry, I just went a little rant. That's my bad. My bad, Pion. Game is seem to get a drop now. What's going on? Well, I think it's proof enough. That obviously I don't have steel barriers anymore when I rebuild them myself. I'm just gonna sit and jug till I get a carpenter. You'll see me then, won't you, little buddy? Oh, it's a carpenter. And well, there's like every drop. Okay, there's two nukes. So if I go up to this barrier up here, they should have steel barriers, right? Yes, steel barriers. Woo! Okay, so the the last three I need to do, they all require me to actually do restarts. 
because you have to do it in different games in order to actually get it. So I gotta deposit all of my points really quickly. Should be Pimp Chimpin' at that point. And if I possibly can, I'll try to do the Permacook Revive if I can find someone to help me do it. But there's no guarantee. Of course, I do want to have it in the video since, well, you know, you, got, you gotta be 100% accurate with this kind of stuff. But like, if you got no friends, how are you gonna be accurate? Oh, this is a lot more points than I imagined. All right, there we go. So, uh, I guess we can just kill ourselves now. Maybe, wait, hold on. Maybe we have Tombstone. Yeah, we do not. So I guess we do gotta do it in three different games. Buy four perks before round five, three times. Oh, yeah, we got Misty again. Hey, yo. Uh, fuck, what do I wanna do? I think I might do Tombstone out of the three I need to do last because it will take the longest. But while I'm doing that, I could uh, work on another one. So, uh. Yeah. Okay. There is four perks before round five. So, uh. Time to get to killing myself. Bang. No Misty. Oh. <laughs> oh. There we go. I should have Tombstone now. So, if I do die, Quick Revive should be the only perk I lose. Bang. It is perfect. There we go. So that is another one we can mark off the list. We only have uh, two more, which is Perma Jug and Cashback. Cashback is a little weird. You might have, if my editor included anyway. Uh, I bought Quick Revive and prone under it. You have to basically do that in multiple games where you have to get Quick Revive or you don't have to go Quick Revive. But a specific perk, buy it, prone under it, and keep doing that process till uh, eventually you get a thousand points whenever you buy a perk. So I, I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know. Dude. I guess I could just kill myself again. Boom. So this next power perk is cashback, obviously. It might take a while to actually get it. So uh, I'm not really going to waste any of you guys' time. So I'm, I'm just basically going to cut to uh, when I get it. Oh my god, I got it. Holy shit. I hope my mic wasn't picking up that video in the background. But I switched to transit and got it super quick. So I guess you can't get this perk or this permanent perk on buried. I guess not. Which uh, sounds pretty stupid. But I'm pretty certain I did get it. So I'm going to go ahead and kill myself real quick and buy the perk again. So what should happen is I should get 1,000 points after buying Quick Revive. Let's see if this fucking works. Yes, there we go. And from what I understand is uh, you basically just have to buy a perk prone under it after you get the icon to show up and everything and just keep doing that process over and over again until you... uh. Get that green flash. It only works on transit and die rise, which I am. Um, wish I fucking knew that in the first plate. But now I do know it. So, uh, I guess, I guess that was, um, the hardest fucking pro perk to get. It really wasn't even that hard. If I knew it wasn't, wasn't on buried, well, it wouldn't be good. But I spent 30 minutes on buried trying to get it. But anyway, let, let's, let's try to get our last perm perk, which is perma jug, which should be really easy. I'm going to switch back to buried because, well, I want to try to get as many perm perks as I can on buried. Perma jug is super easy to get. I should have no problem. Let's get to it, baby. Okay, so the last round perk I need to do is Perma Jug, as I said, and all you need to do for this one is just die out three times with that Quick Revive. So, uh, I mean, you know, uh, go ahead and throw ourselves off the map real quick. Third death. Okay, so now I'm in my fourth attempt, and if, big iffy, I should have Perma Jug, so I think I could take two hits and not die. And, of course, we're, we're Misty. <laughs> Best character in God Zombie's history. I gotta wait for a damn zombie to show up. Last score, man. Just one zombie. Oh. Oh, wait. Can you take three hits? Oh, you can take three hits before dying. Oh my god. No way. So I do have it. It's pretty good. So that was basically the last round perk of the video. I know I said a uh, quick revive. I have no friends. But before the video does end, I'm going to try to see if I can find somebody to help me get this round perk. But if not, I guess I'll cut to the outro right now. But I did find somebody to help me. His name's Grey Ghost. Thanks for helping me with this, by the way. Um, yeah, that's kind of it. So I guess let's go ahead and just cut to me trying to get Perma Quick Revive with him. So I'm gonna have to buy Quick Revive and just go ham. Alright, I'm gonna have so many needles in my ass. I'm gonna put all the needles up your butt. <laughs> <laughs> Prostate. Yo, you're Misty! That's my girl. Stop hitting on my girl. Right, hold on, hold on. I gotta, gotta, gotta get that Q QR. Hold on. Get you, get that QR. you need power? Oh, it's all over. <laughs> this is all over. Do you not just have infinite money in the bank? I do. No. How am I gonna get back up to quick revive though? Uh, paralyzer. Fucking open the damn thing. I'm not really all funny. right, fine. We're gonna we're gonna have an entire section of the video dedicated just to you. 
My money's gone. What happened? Get the fuck out of the way. I literally just put some in there. Like I put like 150k in there, like 30 yeah, minutes ago. Yeah, the bank up hotel name is kind of weird. Cause I, I just. Eh. I just... <laughs> Shut up. They don't call me that. It's a slur in some language. Yo, can you buy this door? All right, it's cool. I never buy that door. Oh yeah, there's a quick revive. Yeah, I need my, I need I need to get a quick revive so I can show the viewers how uh, how effective it is. I was just gonna share money, but yeah. Ooh, my yeah, brain's making money. weird noises. Your brain? Yeah. Okay. I don't know how to describe it, but it's like TV static if TV static was a gel. That is the absolute best what? way to describe it. Like, you know how like, if, if you have like a pack of like, uh, like almost smoothie consistency, you can hear like all like the little ice crystals like sliding against each other. That's what it sounds like in my brain, right? like in my brain stem. I'm sure I should go to the doctor. But where are we running to? We just ran an entire circle. <laughs> yeah, we need it. We need it. I'm just going to grab the paralyzer. This is such an ordeal. We're making this so much more complicated than it has to be. It, we really are. We could just like restart, but uh, fuck that. This is more entertaining. We gotta we gotta lengthen the video a little bit. <laughs> I've been yeah. recording for two hours. That's how <laughs> shit this is. I've been crying for two hours straight. Which ones do you have left besides the quicker vibe? This one. This is the oh, last this one. one. This one. I don't have friends, bro. <laughs> you have me. I have you now. I paid you to be my friend. Paid me, paid me what? I paid you like 10 bucks, <laughs> five of which you can't even get at. <laughs> okay. Wait, how are you gonna get me up there? Oh yeah, wait, what? I don't, I'm I the one I getting like, it. Let me, I got the Galvies. Let me go just like give you all my money. See, I'm paying you. You're paying me in buried bank money. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. I hear Leroy just making noises. You're giving it all to me? <laughs> You're such a gentleman. Hours not even on. That's like the most important part. Yo, of I opened the candy shop, but I didn't turn the fucking power on. <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? What are we doing? I do not know. I haven't played Buried in a while. I'm used to like Black Ops. I'm used to Black Ops 3 Origins where there's just no power. I'm trying to figure out how to... Yo, is that a crystal? Oh my god, no way. Crystal meth? I think there is a way. You just gotta, gotta go all the way up into the tunnels. There. Yeah, I'm already I here. I literally gave you all that money for nothing. Yeah, I know. I, I was confused. I can't really give it. I make mean, it out of gal knuckles and give it back to you. Oh, right. Yeah, we're doing this now. Yeah. You just hurt Leroy. He, this man ain't do nothing, bro. Fuck you, Arthur. <laughs> Wait, right, he gotta... climbed into the window? He <laughs> 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 I have never <laughs> seen that animation. He's yeah, saying, like, <laughs> over here, he climbed into the fucking window. Oh I my god. I didn't know that was fucking possible. Well, I guess we know now. Oh, so I'm gonna run out of grenades. I just have to have the zombie fucking hit me. What? I have the jug from her. Bro, how are you this bad at zombies? I can't even down properly. Don't worry, I have it too. Oh, this is actually so sad. Yeah, this is, it's I think actually, you lose it after downing four times, so uh, we'll be good a, soon. What an interesting segment in the video. Right? I'm just watching Misty get fucking slapped. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this goes crazy. He's gonna wallpaper of this. I'm just staring at zombie crotch right now. He's, he's kind of flat, not gonna lie. Didn't think you'd be spending your night doing fucking this. <laughs> no, I was programming my Discord bot, and I'm like, hey, you have you have plutonium <sighs> block ops too? Yeah, my, my my other friend that I asked first doesn't have it because he's that guy that's like, I gotta have it on Steam. Like, Fuck yeah, off. okay. <laughs> like, I hate people who do that because I have it on Steam. You just launch it through Plutonium. I have a guy in my server who only plays on Steam, even though most of the servers on Plutonium, because we're not paying a hundred bucks for Black Ops One. He's like Steam only, no Plutonium. I'm like, why? Just play Plutonium. Yeah, no, I don't see the and his, the, uh, see his the appeal. His argument was, it's already hard enough to find people on Steam. How am I going to find people on Plutonium? I'm like, I don't know. It's probably because it has a bigger user base than Steam. Like, all your arguments are just not well informed. What are we at Wait, right now? do I, like, not you get it if I... already have 15 downs. This might be a problem. Two hours later. All right, about 327 downs. Still don't have the perma perk. Well, imagine it doesn't work on Barry. I swear... Oh. Oh, let's go. We got it. That's we got it. Me. Let's see how fast I revive you now. Oh yeah, it's like fucking stupid. Yeah, yeah it's like really stupid. <laughs> it's a little less than a second. Well, that's basically been the video. Every primer perk in one single video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any just wonky, wacky ideas that are actually good ideas that might be original, let me know. If not, just leave me a like, comedy, maybe, please. Would make me happy. But yeah, that's it. See you guys in the next video. Peace out. I love all of you.